Hi everyone, welcome back to Beauty Beyond 40. Today's video is very exciting. It's a video that I know you've all been waiting for. It is my icon laser video, taking you through the process of removing the brown spots on the backs of my hands. Before we get started with the video, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel before you leave so you don't miss my videos. I also have a private Facebook group all about beauty devices that I would love to have you join. I'm also on TikTok and Instagram. I'll leave links to all of this down in the description in case you're interested. I wanna give a special thank you to Sinosure for sponsoring this video and supporting my channel. My sponsors really help keep my channel thriving so I can create quality content for you, so thank you so much. Now, if you've been following me on social media, on YouTube, or any of my platforms, you know that the brown spots on the backs of my hands had been bothering me for a really, really long time. They're very, very stubborn to get rid of and it's really just from being out in the sun my whole life and not wearing sunscreen on the back of my hands. I wear sunscreen on the back of my hands all the time now, but I never did when I was younger and I wish I could go back to my 20s and just start wearing sunscreen because it really, really does show up on the back of your hands as you get older. I was spending so much time on my face and on my neck using all of my beauty devices and all my skincare to keep my face and neck in really great shape and then my hands were just really showing their age and I felt like they didn't match and I was starting to get embarrassed. So when Sinusure reached out, they said that they wanted to partner with me on a video, I was able to look at all the treatments that they offer. And you can research treatments that are available. Then you can find a provider in your area of that treatment. I was not exactly sure what treatment I needed. I knew that I wanted to get rid of the brown spots on the backs of my hands. I did end up getting the Icon Laser. So if this is something that you're interested in, you can go search for the Icon Laser on the Sinusure website and then find a provider in your area. Sinusure connected me to Profiles in Beverly Hills and I was able to do a consultation with the two wonderful doctors that helped me. So they looked at the skin in the back of my hands and they said, we really think the Icon Laser would be a great fit for you. I love that they took the time to go through the consultation because there's a lot of choices out there and I felt a little overwhelmed. So it was really nice that they helped me figure out that that would be the best treatment for me. I'm gonna take you through the process of going into the Profiles Beverly Hills office. I have footage that I shot of getting all of the treatments. I have before and after photos. I'm going to take you through all of that and if you still have have questions about the icon laser please leave them in the comments below so that I can help you out like I said before I started out with a consultation just arrived here at profiles at 9201 Sunset Boulevard let's go inside and for my first appointment the doctor talked me through the whole process so that I knew what to expect made sure that I wasn't nervous about anything this is dr. Littner tell everybody about the icon laser like what absolutely yeah, yeah. so the icon laser by sign so the icon is the platform that the laser uses what we're going to be doing today is IPL, which is intense pulse light. And this is a, a range of light frequencies that are used to deal with pigmentation. Brown spots are just from me not wearing sunscreen like over the years out in the sun. I never took care of my hands, which if you're 20, make sure you wear your sunscreen everywhere. Sunscreen is number one. I you mean, see this a lot in California, you know, especially with really active people. Yeah. You're outdoors, you're at the beach, you're on the water doing things. and. It's not the kind of thing you think of, like, hey, this you is don't. Gonna be worried about sun. So. You don't think about it. And yeah. so um, my question to you, though, is this type of laser, if I didn't want to get it on the backs of my hands, could I get it, like, on my chest? Yes. I think that's a common area. So areas we often treat are face, face, chest, areas that get a lot of sun exposure. So you can treat on areas of the back as well. But the beautiful thing about the icon is it has different heads for each different, you know, use. And so oh, great. this, this Max G, is the, the one that's best for treating pigmented lesions. Awesome. So, All right. Like well, we're going to go ahead and get started. They're going to numb up the back of my hands to minimize the discomfort because it is a powerful laser. So we're going to get started with that. First, they put the numbing cream on and they give it time to work to numb your skin. We ended up not using the numbing cream later on because the back of my hands just aren't sensitive. The doctor was saying that the face and the chest tend to be a little bit more sensitive, but the back of the hands, it wasn't a problem at all. I definitely recommend trying out the numbing cream just to make sure because I always recommend a conservative approach because you don't know how your skin is gonna react. So I did do the numbing cream the first time and then for the other three treatments, I did four in total, at least 30 days apart. I did not use the numbing cream. The next step is to warm up the laser. He put a layer of gel on the areas we were gonna treat. And then he just ran the laser across the spots on my back of my hands and just 
delivered the light pulse where I needed it. And this is the same thing that I did the second time, third time, and fourth time. And then it was over, it was really, really quick. And then we wipe off the gel. And then I was really careful to have sunscreen on the back of my hands. So the treatment was really, really fast. And then you wait 30 days. And what happens is the spots will darken, at least for me, they would get a little dark before they'd start to fade. So that's the healing process. And then they will appear lighter after 30 days. So I went in for my first treatment, I waited 30 days, then I went in for my second treatment, same thing, except I didn't do the numbing cream, I just went straight to the laser. And I did ask the doctor to increase the intensity on the laser because I could take it, I really wanted it to work. So we did the second treatment, and I did the third treatment, and then the fourth treatment. And by the fourth treatment, we really, really increase the intensity of the laser because we really wanted it to work. And if you have brown spots on your hands, your chest, your face, you know, if you deal with this condition, you know that these spots are so, so stubborn. So I like that the doctor started out conservatively, but then as time went on, we really increased the intensity because I wanted to see results. So I am gonna show you now the results from beginning to end. You can see how I started. Then I'm gonna show you before and after how my hands look before and after. And I can tell you I'm thrilled. You can see my hands look so much better. I'm really careful to wear sunscreen on the back of my hands whenever I'm outside. I try to limit sun exposure. I'm thrilled at how much better my hands look. It was really easy, it was really quick. The doctors were so nice. The whole process was really easy. And again, I'm gonna leave links to the Sinosure website. You can read more about the Icon laser and find out where you can get it in your area. But it was really quick, virtually painless. Um, after each treatment, it did sting a little bit because the laser is hot when it's pulsing the light into your hand, but it didn't feel anything more uncomfortable than anything else that I used. It was definitely manageable. It was just a slight discomfort that went away probably like an hour after the appointment. So I definitely recommend it. It was really quick. It was easy, almost pain-free, and it definitely worked for me. That's my video for today about the Icon laser. I would love to know down in the comments below, have you tried the Icon laser? Have you attempted to fade the brown spots on the back of your hands or on your chest or your face, let me know down in the comments. I would love to answer any questions you have about the Icon laser, about this treatment, about my process. Please leave questions below. And if I don't know the answer, I can reach out to Sinusure or to Profiles Beverly Hills and help you get the answer because I would love for all of you to get the same amazing results that I did. So again, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my channel before you leave and I will see you in the next one. Bye.